Hi, thanks for tuning in. Um, just real quick video. There's a debate between Dr. Ehrman and Jonathan Sheffield regarding the Byzantine text, and that's something I'm really interested in. I'm very interested in the Byzantine text. I'm not entirely sure where I land on some of these issues, but um, one of my favorite YouTubers, uh, Matthew Everhard, did a really interesting video on the Textus Receptus and uh, the critical text. And I've decided to start putting out some videos in regards to my interest in the Byzantine uh, text. Not entirely sure where I'm going to land on some of this stuff, but uh, it's been something I've been interested in really actually for 20 years. I kind of got interested in it when I was a teenager and it sustained my interest all this time. So be looking forward to that. My impression of the um, Dr. Ehrman and, and Jonathan Sheffield debate that is a very cordial debate. Uh, both gentlemen were very um, respectful to one another. Uh, honestly, this is uh, Dr. Ehrman's field. I mean, he studied under Bruce Metzger. Um, <laughs> I was impressed that uh, Jonathan had the courage to uh, go up against him. It was an interesting debate. I thought that uh, Dr. Ehrman honestly d demonstrated a better mastery of the field than uh, Jonathan did, um, although I thought Jonathan made some good points. But honestly, the things that I'm really interested in, the reasons why I'm very interested in the Byzantine text form, um, it seemed like they were kind of left to the side. So, you know, I've been thinking about these things, studying these things, and I want to share with you some of the things I've been learning in regards to that. So, tune in for that. If you're interested in the Byzantine text, if you're interested in the Textus Receptus, if you're interested in the intersection between um, the critical text and the Byzantine text, I've actually just re finished recording a video that I'm going to post, um, hopefully, Lord willing, next week if I can get through the editing. And uh, so just uh, happy Reformation Day and the Lord bless you today.